Y'all get ready. Yes, you get ready. This news in the streets. Join us and tune in for the tea. Breaking news with integrity. So sell your friends and your family. It's the lovely TV show. Bringing you good tea and good vibes. It's the lovely TV show. Be sure to share, like, and subscribe. All right, tea sippers. I told y'all before it was only going to be a matter of time before Blueface and Krishan Rock would be back together and she'd be skinning and grinning with that toothless grin, happy to be around her baby daddy. So if you guys do not know, they are currently trending all over social media. This entire situation is nuts. Right now, Jaden Alexis is trending, Krishan Rock, Blueface. It's a lot of stuff trending, okay? So what went down is that basically earlier today, uh, Krishan popped up on Instagram and posted a picture of Blueface and Krishan Jr. in bed together. And they're both knocked out. <laughs> this baby's so cute. They're both knocked out. So Krishan Jr., who now, you know, has a Instagram page of his own, writes this. Daddy and I at Blueface Baby with a hand heart emoji. And then Blueface replies back on his son's um, Instagram. And he says, Rock had my phone, but it's me and my son. So fuck it. So, of course, when people saw this, they were like definitely shocked to see them, you know, in bed together. But then other videos started coming out online and you can see Blueface and Krishan. I guess he flew down to Baltimore and he's literally at the gas station. He has a big cornbread smile on his face. Y'all go ahead and check out this video, honey. Yeah. 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 We outside. Yeah. And, and we in Seymour, Kev. Tell them how long you knew me, This bro. ain't LA, Kev. We in Seymour. Tell them how long you knew me, About bro. All right, so y'all see him. He's shouting out Seymour. He's still, you know, still got a bang and represents Schoolyard. We see you, Blue. Um, on top of that, what was kind of disturbing to me is the, the baby's there at the gas station, not in the car seat. I get it if you have to run and get gas, your baby's in the car. Why are they just having this baby all outside? He wasn't even a week old. He was sitting at a football game. Then they had him at church in front of all these folks. Like I said on Discord, I had no idea that they were back trying to enforce the damn masking policy. But I went to the Apple store on Friday because my MacBook was having issues. And damn near everybody in the Apple store had a mask on. I've been in the house lately since, you know, Labor Day, since my housewarming party. So I haven't really been out like that. So I didn't realize a lot of people were back masking. So if I'm seeing people back masking, it makes Makes me nervous for this little baby whose immune system has not been developed yet and he's around so many people with c19 and everything floating around i don't think he needs to be at the gas station with the mama posing for selfies and jumping in videos but child i digress okay so then all of a sudden it goes down okay on instagram so Jaden alexis ends up jumping online and she starts going off she says, a gas station is crazy, laughing emoji. Then she says, I stand on anything I say, period. I'm sorry, y'all, I'm not fake. A dead beat and shooting a music video or in a studio for fun is different, but go off. I know y'all need the clout. Who's watching the baby? My new manager would never. Then she says, maybe I'm the clout, no convo without me. Me being his baby mama is still up for debate, but go off. I know you need clout. I'm sorry to all the fans. I'm not with MILF music no longer. I do not condone bullying and anything on his page is no longer my consent. Then she says, my BD and op, sorry to disappoint y'all. He's a narcissist, a liar, and a weirdo. Somebody else says, Jaden made MILF music, nobody else. And she says, thank you. Then she says, you weirdo bitch. I'm the only one who ever had your back. I held you down, man. Y'all see this? Narcissist, manipulative, shaking my fucking head. 
Then Blueface says, I try to help my people and they always turn on me. So of course, like a typical narc, he has to start playing victim. So then he goes on to say, I just want my kids to be good. These bitches is grown already. I try to help my people. They always turn on me. I sign both my baby mamas and I guess I'm the problem. I don't know how to be a deadbeat. I'm sorry I can't live up to you guys' bad dad expectation. Child, please, please, I hope all y'all have y'all tiny violin ready. Because he done wrote a whole song and dance, child. Let me go ahead and put on my Mother Goose glasses, honey. He goes on to say, I took care of her because she was there when I was nobody. But imagine you trying to be somebody and your bitch keep telling you you won't make it. You build resentment, motivation, and when you get on, these random females believe in you and support you more than somebody you knew your whole life. When I first started rapping, Jaden didn't support me or my music. That's why I never really took her seriously when I got on. One day, I was on my way to the studio, and she told me I would never be Nipsey or P. Diddy. It was motivating to prove her wrong. That's the reason I ain't marry her. You went from a good girl to a regular girl that fast. Shake my head. Sorry, I couldn't say fuck my son for you, but I can't believe you would expect that of me, knowing the role I play in my kids' life. If any female made me choose between them and my kids, they might as well kill themselves. You just killed your whole image. Shake my head. I guess you guys was right. She's not an A1. Bitch probably been going like the rest of them. Then he says, Jaden could wake up tomorrow and tell me she want to be anything and I'm going to support and invest in it before I tell her she won't make it. Literally built a studio for her to do it at her convenience, but I guess I'm a cheater, so that exempts the good guy in me. But I've always cheated and I'm fully aware I'm accountable for my role. I play in these females' lives. I definitely am a part of the problem, but damn, I just be trying to put them on for real. I hate when I gotta get up and I hate when I gotta get up and a bitch asks where you going to the deadlock. She definitely inspired a lot of me to go harder, but I feel the way that she didn't believe in me. That's why we had two that's why we had a two way relationship and I'd indulge with fans and make me feel like they believe in me just venting. Then he says, listen to my bars when I first started rapping. It was all about Jaden for real. I had to wake that shit. I had to wake that bitch up because she was sleep on me. It was bitter. It was a bittersweet feeling. She motivated me because I wanted to prove her wrong. Do your homework. Then Jaden says, now I get what they mean by why you tweeting about another bitch when you with the bitch. Why would I? They only believe in you because you had some to show for it. I worked two jobs and I walked to work while he sat and sold weed at my mama house. Cut the bullshit on me, 100. Then she says, I walked to work to save a dollar so he could sell a dime. Damn, I was dumb. My bad, y'all. He forgot I'm him in girl form. We can go tit for tat. Bay, 10 years, I got something to show for it, bitch. Then they continue to go back and forth. I'm not reading anything else. I just don't care at this point. Um, but then after that, uh, there was videos of Krishan and Blueface in the studio together. So she's back rapping. They're making a music video. Um, definitely using this baby, like I said, as a commodity. So on top of them making the music video, uh, Blueface is posting pictures and video with the baby, kissing on the baby. And then Blueface's mama went off, cause you know Carlisa gotta jump in anything concerning her son, child. She can't let no good drama go to waste. So y'all go ahead and check out these videos real quick. I love the way that you smell. Every time I catch a body, I'm happy. I don't gotta go to jail cause he grabbed me at the night time all these hoes look like granny Your man go out and get a baby and you decide to stay with your man You post a book of flight and say oh hell no we need to get down uh, there and get some and go check on him uh, Yes it's your responsibility uh, if that's your man Cause it's gonna be your responsibility uh, if something don't go right <laughs> You gonna be sitting there looking at that man Yes, ma'am. That's if you gonna be with a motherfucker that got kids. That's your uh, responsibility. Yes, ma'am. It is. Cause when you get to heaven, God gonna say, "Oh, did you withheld that man from helping that child?" 
did, did you did you help him with his children? Because when you sign up to be with a motherfucker that, ooh, I'm cussing on Sunday. I'm trying to stop cussing, but every time I talk to you, I might have to get off the internet. Whew, sorry, Jesus. I'm trying. I can't deliver these messages to these people that you done sent over here because they not ready to receive it and they get on my nerves. Yes, ma'am. To the young lady who said, not your responsibility. If you were a man and you got kids with that man, and them your siblings, brothers and sisters, yes, ma'am, it's your responsibility. Because them your own kids going to ask you where my brother at. Your own kids going to look up at you and say, what, why you didn't take me to see my brother? So, yes, ma'am, it's your responsibility. She was supposed to get it, pay for the plane ticket and go check on his son. That's his son, his heir, his seed. No matter where it came from, God seemed fit to give him that baby, and that baby here now. So, that, now you women know what to do. I, the mama told you what you supposed to do. So, if I'd have had Jaden sitting like, sitting like a motherfucking G right now, though. Bitch, you get them tickets? Y'all going to see that baby tomorrow? Nah, she don't fuck with me, though. She got me blocked. So, when you blocked, when you block the mama, you blocked your own blessings. All right, so y'all just saw the video. Y'all saw Krishan signing to MILF Records, you know, with the toothless grin. Happy to be back around her baby daddy. This entire situation is a hot mess. This is worse than a damn telenovela um, series. It's just, like I said, they gonna be cool today. They'll be into it again next week. Jade and Alexis will be back playing her position. You know, at this point, I feel like they're all doing this for clout and attention. And the sad part is that there is a real baby involved in all of this mess. A baby who did not ask to be here. A baby which for so long, neither one of them wanted. And now the sudden you know everybody's gaga goo goo over the baby that you know for months he demanded that she abort for months she contemplated about aborting I'm glad she kept the baby but this whole entire situation with them going back and forth at this point is just nauseating um basically the fans are now once again dragging Jade and Alexis the memes are being <laughs> The, the memes are being cranked out. They are just going in on this girl. Um, the whole situation is just insane. People are once again rooting for Blueface and Krishan. I don't know why. The whole situation is a mess, child. But let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Let me know y'all's thoughts on all of this mess that's going on with Blueface, Krishan, and Jaden Alexis, with them getting back together, and the fact that, you know... Blueface wasn't there at the birth. It was all this drama. But now the son, he found time to go to Baltimore to go be with the baby. But while they're finding time in Baltimore, I'm sure they're hooking up. Um, they're also working on music and everything else. So like I said, he knows where the money resides, okay? So go ahead and leave a comment. I love to know y'all's thoughts. Make sure you guys like the video. Feel free to share the video. Most importantly, make sure you're still subscribed to the channel. And I'll talk to y'all later. Deuces. If you want the latest news in the streets, join us sentiment for the tea. Breaking news with integrity, so tell your friends and your family. It's the Lovely Tea TV Show, bringing you good tea and good vibes. It's the Lovely Tea TV Show, be sure to share, like, and subscribe.